recently wrote about this in one of our most recent books. Leaders, uh, you, you're leaders of this organization. Leaders refuse to play the blame game. They don't blame routine, they don't blame them, they don't blame them, they don't blame the market, they don't blame the customer, they don't blame you know, passive or disengaged people. They say the biggest problem, or we say the biggest problem and the real enemy that we face in any organization is often us, ourselves. We act as though we are powerless. And you know what, we're not. We're just not. Be the change that you wanna create within Smurf at Kappa. Be the change that you wanna create within your team. Be the change that you wanna create with yourself, which is self-leadership. Be the change that you wanna create with your people, leading others. Be the change that you wanna create in this organization and be the change, ultimately then, that you create in this whole industry, this whole marketplace. You have the power to do that and Smurf at Kappa is paving the way I mean, they are really on a journey of gifting you with tools and strategies and ideas and insights that are literally transformative if you own them, if you embrace them, and if, first and foremost, you start with you. We can't look at our people and expect them to change if we haven't been a role model for change ourselves. Lead. Leadership has become so complicated. I love leadership and I've been studying leaders and I've been practicing leadership for all of my, not just adult life, my life. My father would have dinner with me when I was seven years old and talk to me about business. He, he planted the seeds of leadership in me when I was that young. What is it? Well, it doesn't have to be complicated. See, I think it's not, it's not a chip that someone plants in us. It's not a part of the DNA that you're born with. It's not a title. It's not a position. It's a privilege. It's a gift. It's, um, it's not a badge of honor, it's not some ribbons that you've earned. It's a choice. It's a choice that you make countless times in every single day to step out of your routine, out of your comfort zone, and step into the place of being wide awake to what's needed and what's, what are opportunities around you. Leadership is a choice. It's a brand. And Bezos said it well. He said, leadership or your personal brand is ultimately what people say about you when you leave the meeting, when you leave the room, when you check out of that conference call. That's what leadership or that's what a brand is. And here's my question. You don't have to answer this out loud. Are you proud of what people think of you when you leave the room? Are you proud of the brand that you've created? Now, think about that answer. And here's my next question, or here's my next comment, I should say. It doesn't matter what brand you've created to date. The good news is, is it's not where you've been, it's where you're going. And this organization believes in you enough that they've actually created a, a, a road to help you improve your brand. Whether you think, yeah, I'm good. I like what people say about me when I leave the room. I'm pretty proud of that. Or you know what, I could work on a few things. Or you know what, mm -mm. I gotta do an about face. I gotta figure this out. It doesn't matter where you are on that journey. The journey never ends.